Hey y'all, I'm Lockleth and for today's video I just wanted to do a little chit chat, catch up with y'all, and kind of go over where I've been while I was gone. But if you would, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell if you enjoy my content. But yeah, before I get into all the tea and get into a little bit of gameplay today, I do have some packs to go through and this isn't going to be my normal amiibo unboxing that i normally do and so i have one series one one series two a three a four that i cut upside down we're doing a very chill video and then two fives so before i start chit chatting and going into things let's go to the first one and we're gonna see this live here annalisa that's a duplicate mint i don't know if i have her Clyde, Knox. I don't think I have Knox. Sheldon, and then the NPC being Timmy. That was series one, now we have series two. And the first one is, is that Keaton? Yes, Keaton. <gasps> I don't have Bo. Filbert, I think I have Filbert. Roccolo, I don't think I have Roccolo. Savannah, I may have, I'm not sure. And then NPC is Copper, series three. We've got Rolf. Laura, Blanche, Bam, Lily, and Rover. And then series four, we have Rosie, Poppy, Walt, <laughs> Croak, Dizzy, and Phineas. I do not have Phineas, so that's cool. All right, series five, we have Rio, half that one. Judy, yep, have these. These are gonna be duplicates. Renee, mm-hmm. Marlo, of course, have that one. Audie, I think I have Audie, yeah. And then Hix, yep, that's pretty much a pack that I already have. And last series five, Brett. Chabwick, I can't remember, I think I have him. Renee, again. Ione, Raymond again. And Celeste, but that's uh, essentially a lot of cards that are potentially new ones. I'll have to weed out the duplicates, but yeah. But I did kind of want to start off with that and then kind of go into a little bit of discussion and gameplay. So let me just put these away and we'll roll right into the game. Alrighty, y'all. We are here on my autumn island of Analia or Analia 2.0. But yes, it has been a moment since I've done some speed builds on this island, but we are here. So I will quickly run through what we did in potentially the last speed build, which was one of my bigger ones, the two part carnival build. So here's kind of what all that looks like. But essentially, um, the tea as to why I was gone was uh, we moved. <laughs> We moved states, we moved homes, we moved jobs, both my husband and myself. Essentially, um, our home that we rented from was getting put up for sale. And so we kind of just made the very instant decision to move closer to my husband's uh, two daughters and um, technically my, my stepdaughters. And so we are closer to them now um, in Texas. And that is the state that we are in now. So hello, Texas people. I am now in your state, hopefully permanently. It's only been, uh, how long has it been? Almost a week and a half now. Loving it so far. <laughs> but we made that decision to move. We thought, why not? This is our moment. This is our time. We don't have kids between the two of us. Why not just move? Some may call that uh, a little bit rash, but we just saw it as, a, as an adventure and just decided to kind of just do the dang thing and uh, pack up our things and uh, be closer to family, aka his kids. So we made the decision January 31st and essentially we're shooting for March initially. That um, was getting very close and we hadn't had um, any, you know, real jobs yet or new jobs, I guess I should say. And by mid-March, both him and I had found jobs. So it took like a month and a half for us each to find jobs and then uh, and to find a, a new place to live in, in Texas. So we are renting another property and we'll be here for the next year until we hopefully can find a, a home is kind of our long-term goal now. We don't wanna be renting forever, but you know, if anyone's aware of the market right now, it's insane. So that might take us some time. 
If you know anything about moving or have moved before, it takes a lot of energy, it takes a lot of time and a lot of focus. And so there was no way I was going to be able to crank out videos and be able to do all of that. Even one video a week, I thought that was possible. And for a while I was doing one video a week because um, we kind of made that initial decision and I thought I could handle it. But as we we're getting kind of closer to that crunch time and actually finding a place, I had had to just stop making videos for a little bit so um you didn't you didn't see a video from me the past two weeks but i did want to fill you in that essentially we've moved we're settled now i started at my new remote work from home job literally last week uh, so we moved on a friday and by that monday i was starting my new job and so was my husband as well it's been a crazy wild ride but we are excited for this new adventure and this new like chapter in our lives essentially but here is some little areas that I did. I just had like grass in this area. There wasn't anything here. So I just kind of designed just a little bit, you know, put a bike, put some plants, some custom codes. And so over here, I did the same thing. I just put some bikes, custom codes, you know, very simple stuff. I debated putting something here, but I think I'm going to do a build where it also involves this beach area. You know, if you have any suggestions for specific builds or things you want to see that fit my autumn island, I know we're nowhere near autumn anymore, but maybe I'll get done by autumn this year. <laughs> we'll see. But add those in the comments below if, if, uh, if you have any design ideas for me. Okay, so we are going up to another area that I worked on. So I did do this little walk up to um, Azalea lives on this part of the island and she's a permanent resident. This unfortunately is Han's house and he is not permanent. That's why he's on the beach. So this eyesore of a home in the midst of everything is not going to be here, hopefully for much longer. And of course Han's is in the distance, but here is this little walk up that I did. Very simple, very um, naturey, <laughs> natural, I guess I should say. Literally, there's chairs everywhere and he sits on the ground. This, this is why he needs to go. So here's a, another little seating area. Some of these items were here, but kind of these were not. So some of this is new. And then the area right outside Azalea's home. So she's got a little pergola here and a greenhouse. And essentially she likes to take care of plants. She's got her little gyroids over here playing all of the songs. And then she's got a tiny little farm over here as well. And then one other area that I did while I was gone was just the area behind her home. I seem to kind of work a lot on the right side in particular uh, on the island here lately, but I just felt inspired. Essentially, there's a shed here and just a boat. And then that's kind of that's kind of where it leaves off. I do have some vines over here. I was planning on kind of working on this area too, but I might leave that for another video. You know, there's not a lot left for me to kind of fill y'all in on without giving away too much of personal things. Essentially, I am ready to be back. I'm ready to do speed builds again. I don't know if I'll go back to two videos a week just yet. I might still shoot for once a week, but if I happen to do two videos in a week, I guess that'll just be an extra little bonus for y'all. But I will say one thing that I was consistent with, or for the most part consistent with while I was gone, was my Instagram. So if you ever want to know kind of what's going on, Follow me on Instagram, follow me on Twitter. I'm definitely more heavily involved on Instagram and sharing at least during um, Monday through Friday, a post every day. So if you ever want to see or hear from me kind of outside of the YouTube space, go follow me over there um, at Lockleth on there and then at Lockleth TWT like Twitter uh, over on Twitter. So yes, that is what the tea is. There's not really anything juicy to say. Really just filling y'all in in regards to where I have been and kind of what I'm up to now. So I'm excited for this new adventure. Like I had mentioned, the doggos, you know, they had to do a little bit of adjusting as well to the new place. They're still getting used to all the sounds, but like, subscribe, and Hit the notification bell if you're excited for speed builds yet again. I am ready to finish off this autumn island so I can start on my new island finally. So thank you so much for watching.